The chief of army staff, Lieutenant General Tawarid Lagmaja, says the Nigerian army will continue to be responsible and responsive in its engagement with the society. He stressed that such commitment in the ongoing end-of-year exercises and operations have strengthened its objectives to combating piracy, oil theft, banditry, kidnapping, terrorism, insurgency, secessionist agitation, and others. He made this known at the closing brief, press briefing of exercise Clean Sweep, declaring Ikeja cantonment free of exploded ordinances. Plus TV defense correspondent Destiny Momo has more. This historical feat has certified Ikeja cantonment safe and free of every unexploded ordinances following the bomb explosion that happened 21 years ago. The closing ceremony which took place at the officers mess 9th Brigade Ikeja cantonment had the Chief of Amistad, General Tawid Lagbaja, in attendance, as well as notable members of other security agencies. The Chief of Army Staff was ably represented by the Commander Engineer Corps Major General Philip Eromosele, who said the Nigerian Army would continue to be responsible and responsive in its engagement with the society, amongst other invaluable additions. As the clean sweep witnessed the deployment of some of the most sophisticated explosive order disposal technologies and techniques available today in the market. These include ground penetrating radar detection systems, drone propagated chemical clearance of vegetation, as well as remote controlled explosive order disposal robots. Additionally, the best Nigerian Army personnel in explosive ordnance disposal and ammunition technical experts from Nigerian Army engineers and Nigerian Army ordnance corps were employed. The efficient mobilization of these men and equipment resulted in a timely search, recovery, and disposal of 2,055 unexploded ordnance of various calibers from the contaminated site. The blast epicenter, measuring over 155,000 square meters, is now safe and secured for immediate productive development. Earlier, Colonel Kazim Abdul Razak, the coordinator of exercise clean sweep, who doubles as the acting director, directorate of explosives search and disposal, and your army engineers informed that during the period the clearance operation lasted, not a single also was deliberately or accidentally detonated at the clearance site. By working in collaboration with other stakeholders, we have not only ensured the safety of our citizens, but also fostered synergy among various security agencies, very much in line with the Chief of Army Staff Command philosophy. In adherence to international best practices as well as quality assurance, the site was double checked by the Nigerian Police Force Explosive Ordnance Disposal and Chemical, Biological, Radiological, and Nuclear Units. They meticulously inspected an area of about 155,000 square meters and certified the site clear, having found any item of UXO during the search. I'm happy to therefore announce that the site of the 2002 explosion is now clear of any form of an exploded ordinance and will today be handed over to the Army headquarters for future developments. I witnessed, I witnessed it during the three months uh, program and be coming to inspect. So I'm also pleased that my, my area is secure now. So it's secure. Clear from any hazard, any identified hazard or potential hazard. You know, one of the common uh, characteristics of a no-go area is that some certain hazard has been identified. Of course, the area will now have a clean certificate of safety. 
the Chief of Army Staff was presented a certificate by the Commander of the Nigerian Police Explosive Ordnance Department, DSP, Award Dele Jude, who represented the Commissioner of Police, Lagos State Command, while declaring Operation Clean Sweep closed. Also, Plus TV Africa and notable media organizations were given awards of excellence for being part of the historical process. Destiny Mama, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.